Now that we have seen many Christmas, now that we have heard many carols, now that we have opened many gifts, how do we write new cheerful heralds? With the smell of mother's baking cookies and the children finally helping with dishes, let's have a cup of cocoa and talk about poetry. Poetry for the seasons, reasons for all life's wishes. Remember the feelings when Santa first gave us cheer and how curious and awe we became of his reindeer. So many ways of decorating the tree this year. The sweet times reminiscing of family and revere. Mother dear, please turn on the holiday tunes. Let us tell you what we went shopping for in June. Things homemade, gifts for the homeless, and so a tune. With faith all through the year, blessings fell and opportune. The gift of a warm made quilt is a little fire, a pocket full of verse and a little chap to inspire. Simple things to call up to before they'd retire. We thought we would create moments, we the supplier, to the living poems and rescue the spirit that wants to tire. We were so happy to see the smiles on their face, with no strings attached, that's the gift of grace. From the depths of our love to the ones misplaced, we gave them the spirit of Christmas to embrace. So our new humorous poet friends, Christmas stories there is restless, getting family and friends on the guest list. And with the modern days of netting, so dearly wish you the spirit and expansion. Merry Christmas, Mr. and Mrs. Hampton.